of hers again. But Branya's isn't with her this time. It feels like this echo is different from the others before. Intruders. Huh? Did did she just speak? You cannot approach. Not good. March! Out the way! The Stellaron! Uh oh. Intruders! You go no Uh, are you sure this isn't the real her? Move can may look like her, but the fragmentum can only create forgeries. Bring her down! Hey! Okay, I know that the character is gonna get a new form, but that's after this. I mean, though. Is this intention meant to. The truth of life and death with this sanctuary is but a vision. Rules are made to be broken. Let's make it quick. With me out here, how can we lose? You're annoying. Fighting is meaningless. Let's go. My turn. Time for a shot. Gotta try hard sometime. Watch this awesome move! Naughty child, nap time. The eternal breeze will bury you. I've no interest in conflict. <laughs> Don't worry about me. Fighting is meaningless. Judgment of eternal winter! <laughs> The sanctuary is but a vision. <laughs> just, just a little something. Think nothing of it. <sighs> Thanks a lot. Rules are made to be broken. <laughs> Here. <laughs> no interest in conflict. <laughs> Let's make it quick. Tough luck running into me. <laughs> Gotta try hard some. Watch this awesome move. Time for a shot. Nap time. Tremble before my power. Oh, I'm okay. Let's go. Try that again. Fighting is meaningless. Naughty child. The truth of life and death. The sanctuary is but a vision. Time for a shot. That's better. Much the world better. Devoured by ice. You can't run. Yeah. <laughs> Here. Rules are made to be broken. Naughty child. <laughs> Judgment of eternal winter. <gasps> Gotta try hard some. Watch this awesome move. <laughs> just, just a little something. Think nothing of it. Much better. Let's make it quick. That for a moment she was an unbeatable boss. Those stairs. It's 
That's the only way forward. Wherever they lead, it must be the end of the journey. I don't want to get to the end so soon. I want my journey to go on forever. Okay, man, man. This means that Branya is up ahead. And so is the fate of the overworld and the underworld. It's all in our hands. <sighs> Strange. I thought I'd feel nervous or afraid, but I don't. The only feeling I have is that none of this seems real. To be honest, you never really get used to them. We always used to rely on Himeko and Mr. Yang. The Express has traveled world after world. We are merely passing travelers. Witnesses to part of a grander story. We invariably avoid getting drawn into turbulence that can decide the fate of a world. But there are always times when we have no choice but to act. Or to put it another way, this is one heck of a first trailblazing expedition. You hit the jackpot. I was about to bore you all with my gloomy reflections, but on second thought, not today. Adventuring with you guys by my side has made me feel like no obstacle is too big. Right on! But you can say whatever you like. A good adventure shouldn't be full of rules and regulations. Helping those in need, befriending those worth counting on, and saving the world a few times along the way. Oh boy, this is a boss fight, isn't it? Okay, Salva, you're gonna be in the team. I don't, I don't think I... Hope that this is gonna work. Ah, it's freezing here. The blizzard's so fierce. Oh, the power from the trailblaze path isn't enough to stop the cold. It means that we're getting closer to the Stellaron and the heart of the Eternal Freeze. <laughs> I'm impressed you can still think up jokes right now. Did the architects build this? Very different from the uniform style of the buildings we saw in the city. Does it look like the palm of a huge hand to you? Yes. We're gonna face the giant robot, aren't we? If Kakolia threatens us by taking Branya hostage... We have to save her. The underworld... No. The entire planet relies on her. There, there. And I guess that's the stair on, I guess. No. Do not 
resist, Branya. Accept the common will. No! I... I don't want this. Look upon their promised future, Branya! A world without it. Poverty without cold, without suffering. A world where people no longer have to pray like prisoners for survival. A world that we can guard for all eternity. 700 years ago, we tried and fought unceasingly, believing that the radiance of human nature could shepherd us towards rejuvenation. <laughs> and to what end? A crushing defeat. Why, when faced with irrefutable strength, is our first thought always to resist? To cover our ears instead of hearing the call? It is the conceit and cowardice entrenched in the depths of human nature. To a face. Cast them aside. Break free of the chains that bind you. The Stellaron will lead humanity to evolve, and they will. Your brainwashing ends here, you witch! Zila? You came. I thought the blizzards had entombed you. You wish. We're not going down before you do. Branya, I don't know what happened between you and them. Even if you explained it to me, I probably wouldn't understand all the crazy details. But there are two things I do know. One, these guys have come through hell to get here, to steal this Stellaron thing. And two, do you remember what I said? If anything happened to you, I'd save you. Do you understand? Even if the damage is done, even if you've completely forgotten our promise, then, then I'm just gonna have to knock you out and bring you back myself. Zila. All of you. <laughs> Finished? I think I've given you long enough to bid farewell. It's time I told you my other reason for bringing you here, Brownie. Huh? I want to witness your choice. I have told you all the truths there are to tell. The deal with the Stellaron, the wish I made to it. There are no more secrets between us. Many years ago, the voice of the Stellaron sounded in my ears for the first time. I was no different from the previous generations of Guardians. I withdrew, refused to hear. I was as you are now, bitterly defending the Architect's so-called preservation. My conviction was once steadfast, unparalleled. Until a sudden change arrived and threw everything into chaos. Another choice appeared before me. A subversion of the old order. And the welcoming of a new world. And compared to the illusory, ever more distant preservation, this was so... I have agonized, long agonized, over how to convey all this to you. Inevitably, the promise tomorrow will transpire. But if you were not there beside me to watch over that new world, then I would descend into torment, Branya. Enduring torment. Perhaps I should be thanking you, outsiders. The pressure you have imposed has at long last compelled me to confront my final weakness. Branya, throughout your life, I have never forced you to submit to my will. You have always will 
always have a choice. As then, so now. Choose, my daughter. <clears throat> Madame Kokolia, I am grateful to you for raising me and for allowing me the privilege of choice. But I... I am sorry, Mother. On this, our final occasion, I cannot stand with you. <clears throat> you say that conceit and cowardice lie in the depths of human nature. <laughs> Perhaps you're right. Desperation sheds light on the darkest recesses of the heart. What about those simply struggling for survival, fighting for something better? I've witnessed their light on the front lines, in the underworld, in places you have overlooked. Our ancestors built this city, striving in the bitter snow to prolong our civilization. Even if this world is doomed to fall apart, we should allow humanity to pave the way to its final outcome. Not hand over our fate to the seed of ruin. We are Guardian's mother. Chosen from among the masses. Our duty is to preserve the world built by humanity. We are not gods. We are not arbiters. You seek to crush human nature underfoot while masquerading as an... as an arbiter and a god. I cannot let you... So... This is your choice. I understand, Branya. Pity. Such a pity that you will never see that resplendent world. Unable to free yourself from the shackles of your mind. <sighs> you know what? You were supposed to be the mother of the new world. The ground! It's shaking! What's happening? <sighs> that sign! The fate of this city, of Bellabog, is sealed. Its future will unfold in our hands. And you will become the foundation of the new world. You must break the old to build the new. The Supreme Guardian commands you. Rise, engine of creation! Oh boy! She can fly? Oh boy! Cool! But oh boy! Let's make it quick. Take this! <laughs> Tie keep up! My tempo! You have the worst luck running into me! Giant like this down. No idea. <laughs> Time for a shot. All better now. <sighs> Ready to jam. Yeah.
times. Watch this awesome move! Turn it up! My turn! Let's make it quick. You can't run! Keep up! Told you I could fight! Rules are made to be broken. Where did that come from? Who's I? Granted by them! Listen to the power surge! Sing! The Stellaron's promise is the only hope for this world. Just as it dispelled the Antimatter Legion 700 years ago. So too will it wipe you from the face of this world! Wait, I'm alone? Alert. I came here, I'm all alone. Let's go. Let's make it quick. Yeah. Let's go. Rules are made to be broken. Yeah. <laughs> Humanity, so weak and foolish, always overestimating their abilities. Let me bestow upon you despair. This is game over. It was fun how much it lasted.